This is Lori with lorystampingplace.blogspot.com and today I wanted to show you what came in the mail. And I didn't get the whole suite, but I did get some of the Sand and Sea collection. So I want to share with you what that is that came. So let's take a peek here and get this down here. So I did get the stamp set. Friends are like seashells. And I just love this stamp set. I love all these different seashells and sand dollar and um, the star starfish and all these little the little ones. And then these are like what you can use to color. And it'll, this one will go with that and that one there and that one there and that one there. So anyway, and um, I can open this up and this is what they they look like. So let's see, that says right there, and then here's some more shells. And I just, I just love this. And I love now uh, they're putting this in here, so I, I really like that on the back. And then also I got the um, the dies, the seaside seashell dies. Try to say that fast. Okay. Anyway, and so these are Stampin' Up's cut and emboss seashells, or dies. So, and these are the seashell ones. So you have this whole big one here. And um, I really like that. And then this is the embossed. So some of it will be embossed. And you'll have to come back and I'll show you what we're going to do with these. So, and then you have... The one for the uh, for the sand dollar and those little seaweedy things and um, this starfish the starfish so that's going to be fun and also we have these opal rounds which I think look like little water bubbles and they have some little um, shiny glittery stuff inside and they're really really pretty those are going to be awesome to use and then also i got the uh, seashells 3d embossing folder so that's what this is here and you can see you can see that and i believe that if i were to take Let's get this out of here again. If I were to take this little die, I believe that it will fit over this. So, yeah, it does. So, pl please come back and uh, check out what we're going to make with this set. And then as I was going through my things, I did find this retired seabed which I thought, ooh, embossing folder, and I thought, oh, that's going to be cool, because I can use this one, too. So, I think that'll be really awesome to use. And then we have the designer series paper, and you can see, you get two of each. And so, I, aren't those beautiful? They're just beautiful. And then this is the reverse side, so it kind of looks like sand. I just love that. And then we have the um, this blue one. And I just heard, uh, oh, I, I can't think, remember who she was, but it said, she said she thought maybe they put salt and then uh, did the colors and then took a photo of it. I'm not sure. But isn't that beautiful, the sand dollars? And then we have this one. And I, I love how they make the colors just coordinate. They just go. And then this is the starfish on the other side. And it's just, I just love it. I love paper like this. And look at this. It almost looks like, to me, it looks like sand and just, I don't know. I like that. There's the sand dollar. I guess the other one wasn't a sand dollar. 
Um, let me see. What was that other one? The other one was starfish. Yeah. And isn't that pretty? I just love it. it looks like a color wash or something. And then there's all the different, the different uh, seashells. And then you have one here that's blue. And I mean, that, that to me just really looks like sand and waves and, and all that. And you have these little dots to use. And then the, the, the colors of the paper are um, Blushing Bride. So I've got the Blushing Bride here. I'm sorry about that. Let me see if I can get this on here. So I have Blushing Bride. And then I have Flirty Flamingo. I'll put that one next. And then I have Melon Mambo, which is really like a hot pink. And then there's Sahara Sand. And I don't have any of Sahara Sand. I keep going to order it over the last few years, but I just never have. So that's as close as I'm going to get till I can get me some. And Seaside Spray, I don't have that one. That one either. And then I have the, so I thought maybe Balmy Blue would work in that color scheme. And then we have So Saffron. And I think all those colors will work real well. So I just wanted to share that with you and um, be sure that you come back and we'll see what we're going to make with it. I'm anxious to get started and use it. So thanks for joining me. And um, also that was Lori's Stamping Place .blogspot.com. Uh, click um, on the, the bell and um, subscribe to my YouTube channel. Thank you so much. Okay, have a good day. Bye-bye.